evidently done something right to have been here 25 years. People have kind of become accustomed to me being here, you know, for some last minute gift items, last minute flowers. So I, I feel it's that trust, just knowing that it's, it's going to get taken care of, you know. I didn't start out to be rich, but uh, I feel I'm rich in a lot of ways other than being financially rich. This past winter, I was dealing with some cancer and treatments and so forth, which put me down physically. I was able to be here most of the time, but it put me down physically. And being the community that we have, they um, rallied and had a benefit for me to help offset some of the medical expenses. There were close to a thousand people that came. It was just overwhelming and very humbling that that we have that kind of a community that, that will come together and uh, then it makes you realize what the value I guess you think you are within the community. Sometimes you know, people go through the motions and it's like, well, nobody cares, but uh, this is a town that cares and, and uh, I think it's just really changed my overall appreciation of, of Macomb and everybody that lives within it. Um, planning to stay for a while, you know, never know what tomorrow's going to bring or what might happen that uh, changes that, you know, but as of right now, I'm planning to stay, stay for the long haul. I'm 57 years old and in that age group, you know, if I close up, what am I going to do, you know, and we try to offer everything that we have to anybody that, that needs it or can make use of it, and uh, I would hope that people will would open their their eyes and their hearts and their arms to accept what we have to offer and and spread the word that Macomb's really a pretty good place to live. So I think with heart and souls, I think they're going they're, they're continuing to work and try to make us maybe make Macomb a little more self-sufficient. I've lived in Macomb off and on for 57 years and now I don't know that I'd be happy really happy anywhere else. Like I say, we're small enough to know, know people, but yet we're big enough to get things done.